Hey, what's up, guys? It's Yudi here, and today I'll be showing you how platoons work in Battlefield 5. So, let's get started. Press Escape, go to Platoons. If you are already in a platoon, then you can see your platoon over here. These are my current platoons. People always ask, can I join more than one platoon? Well, the answer is yes, you can join more than one platoon. You can join two platoons or three platoons. You can see I'm there in three platoons right now. If you want, you can join 10 platoons. Here you can see platoon members playing. You can join your platoon members from here. Even if they are not in your friend list, you can still see people playing from your platoon here. Just click here, whoever you want to play with, and then you can play with them. If you want to find a platoon, then click on find platoon. Here you can see the platoons. If you have people in your friend list who are already in a platoon, then you'll be able to see their platoon over here. If you don't see the platoon you wanna join, then you can type the platoon name over here. After searching you'll be able to see the platoon. And then click on the platoon you wanna join. As you can see I'm already in first platoon. So I'll click on this second one. Click on apply to join. That's all for now and now the platoon officer will accept it. For some reason if you want to cancel the application then you can click on cancel application. You can see your platoon members and their ranks here. Here you can report a platoon even if you are not a member of that platoon. You can create your own platoon here. Platoon information. Here you can give all your platoon information so that people can read this information before they apply. You can type your platoon name here. Platoon name should be between 3 to 24 characters. You can type your platoon tag here. Your platoon tag should be between 2 to 4 characters. Give some description of your platoon here. You can give all the history of your platoon here. Access type. What type of access you want to give to other people? If you want, you can keep it open. Anyone can join your platoon directly. If you want, you can use apply to join. So that people need to apply in order to join. After that, you can accept or reject on who can join your platoon. Closed. If you don't want anyone else to join your platoon, then you can use this option and no one will be able to join your platoon. Platoon Emblem Over here you can select any emblem you want to use for your platoon. And then click on Create. You can see my platoon is created now. Here you can see overview of the platoon. You can see the platoon name here. This is the platoon tag. Here you can see number of members in the platoon. Here you can see representing in yellow. That means I'm representing this platoon. If you have a question what does it do then the answer is when you're playing in game it will show the tag of this platoon in front of your name. If you want you can stop representing the platoon. And if you want, you can represent the platoon from here. Now you won't be able to see representing over here anymore. Here you can see the character name of the owner. This is the avatar of the owner. General is the highest rank of the platoon. Here you will be able to see the description of the platoon. Here you can see all the members of the platoon. General. General is the leader and often the founding member of a platoon. This is the highest rank and has access to all platoon settings. The general can change the name, the tag, membership access type or even disband the platoon. There can only be one general. If you are the general, you can promote another player to general in your place and you'll get demoted to his rank. You can do this if you want to leave the platoon you created. You can see the number of people who have this rank. You can see people over here who have this rank. You can see player name here, their rank here, their avatar here, 
If you want, you can see their profile from here. Kulner Kulner is second in command. The Kulner has access to most platoon settings, including editing the description and emblem. Lieutenant Lieutenant is rank and file officers. Lieutenants can approve and reject membership applications if those are required in your platoon. Private A private is a standard member of the platoon and does not have any access to platoon management settings. Manage You can manage things from here if you have the required rank. You can accept or reject applications from here. You can edit platoon information. You can change platoon emblem. You can disband platoon from here. More. From here you can leave platoon. From here you can report platoon. If you are general then you can't leave platoon unless you promote another player. If you have any new application then you will be able to see yellow dot on manage. Click on manage. Click on application. You will see number of applications here. Right now we can see one because there is only one application. You will see applicant name here and their avatar. Here it displays the time since they applied. You can accept or reject from here. If you want, you can see their profile from here. Here you will be able to see the player name, avatar and rank. You can see any player's profile from here. You can also change their rank from here. Or you can kick player from here. Private does not have any access to platoon management settings. Lieutenant can kick, promote, demote lower rank if those are required in your platoon and link rented server to platoon. Kulna have all the permission which lieutenant have including editing the description and emblem. General is the highest rank and has access to all platoon settings. The general can change the name, the tag, membership access type or even disband their platoon. There can only be one general. If you are the general, you can promote another player to general in your place and you will get demoted to his rank. You will need to do this if you ever want to leave the platoon you created. Currently, only 100 members can be in one platoon. If there are more than 100 members in your team, then you can make multiple platoons with the same tag so they can all be recognized. Now that you made another person general, you can leave the platoon if you want. You can report the platoon from here. If you will leave the platoon, then you have to apply to join again. If you are a general and you want to disband the platoon you created, then you can disband it from here. In about, you can read platoon information here. If you want to go back to your game, then press escape, click on battlefield 5 or whichever you want to play and it's done. That's all for today. If you have any questions, write down below in the comments. See you later.